a number of significant alternative cryptocurrencies had a decline on Monday due to significant token unlocks, which dragged on prices on a generally bad day for the overall crypto market. These cryptocurrencies, including native tokens of DYTX, Optimism, and SUI. According to statistics from Token.Unlocks and CryptoRank, the quantity of altcoins will rise by around $650 million this week. Nearly twice as many tokens as there are currently on the market will be added to DYDX's circulating supply, valued at about $480 million. Large unlocks for OP, SUI, Axilor, Immutable X, and Hetera are also planned for the upcoming days. When an asset supply is increased through token unlocking, early investors and other coins that have been vesting at the time can receive their coins. According to a research conducted earlier this year by the crypto analytics firm The Thai, large unlocking events typically result in price drops since investor demand for the asset cannot keep up with the rise in supply. Axlo or AXL dropped 10% in the past 24 hours as about $18 million worth of tokens, some 5% of its market capitalization were added to its supply Monday during its scheduled monthly token unlock, including to early investors, according to CryptoRank data. DYDX was down 7% during the same period ahead of release of $480 million worth of tokens on December 1st. OP declined nearly 6% with unlock of $40 million in tokens looming on November 30. Talking about SUI, it plunged 8.8% during the day as its supply will increase by $48 million over the course of the week. Axie Infinity, a well-known blockchain game, will offer commercial value to NFT owners, enabling them with the option of producing and selling certified products. This is in sync with the introduction of an Axie merch outlet. According to Sky Mavis, specific holders of the game's Mystic and Origin Axie NFTs will be allowed to use their digital assets as mascots for developing Axie-oriented enterprises. This comes with 4,877 4, wallets from a total of 11.9 million Axies which have been minted and belong to a segment of only 0.04% of all Axies. The opportunities will come with establishing cafes, comic books, restaurants, toy types and more ventures utilizing the Axie IP. Sky Mavis has plans to boost user-driven content connected with the Play to Earn game. Sky Mavis will introduce an offline outlet selling branded hoodies, t-shirts, a $300 Axie figurine and many other products. The collection is based on the initial Axies minted in 2018 in the form of a code. The customers will be allowed to make payments utilizing cryptocurrencies and fiat. The initial 5,000 purchasers will come in for a free Axie NFT and the option of winning one out of three Mystic Axies. Enthusiasts in the Philippines who utilize the Grab Ride sharing application can earn points and merch discounts. Crypto buyers can unlock rewards and spend them. Sky Mavis has committed to put in 20% of merch profits towards the Axie community treasury. This may be an example for various other platforms and work towards accepting NFTs. HTX has started withdrawal services, though restricting to selecting cryptocurrencies including but not limited to Lena, Hot, FTT, Mask and EXO. More tokens will eventually get support for the same functionality. HTX has said that it will make those developments public in the coming days. HTX resuming services was crucial when the crypto firm was reportedly attacked by malicious actors stealing funds worth approximately $30 million. The firm had stated that the issue was resolved and that they were restoring services as soon as possible. Most of the services were back in line within 24 hours. The exploit was reported on November 22, 2023, and the value of the theft was roughly $13.6 million. HTX has committed to compensating its customer for the loss they suffered. Notably, normal operations were not affected by the $30 million hack. Also, the amount extracted from the platform per HTX reflected only a small portion of the total funds. Justinson linked other platforms have also witnessed hack attacks in recent times. This includes Tron and BitTorrent. Overall, firms have been exploited four times in the last two months. This is a serious matter, but The Sun has said they are investigating it. Founded in 2013, HTX has expanded its horizon to cover many digital tokens for its customers. Over 375 cryptocurrencies are listed on the platform, along with 300 plus trading pairs. An extensive list of token and uh, pairs supported by HTX can be checked in the HTX review. 
which further sheds light on the number of ways in which customers can connect with the customer support team. That's all for today. For more such updates, watch Tree.tv or log on to our website www.treeverse.tv.io or scan the QR code. Thank you.